you guys welcome back to my channel oh my god i know it's been a while i've been gone for i think about three months and most of you know why i've been gone that's because i've been pregnant and but i i just gave it about three weeks ago so i've been on maternity leave even though i took my maternity leave way before i gave birth but i've missed youtube and all my sewing that i needed to like come back right after i gave birth so like i said earlier i gave birth three weeks ago and i couldn't wait to get back and a lot of you guys have been asking after me so yes i am back and i am ready to give you guys our regular sewing tutorials so to kick start my comeback i wanted to show you guys all the fabric that i have been accumulating during the course of three months that i've been away so i have literally bought just fabrics for this holiday season for all the dresses or skirts or pants that i'm going to be making for this festival period and that's what i'm going to be showing you guys today so if you want to see the fabric that i have in stock definitely keep washing so yes we're going to start um i have some ideas of things that i'm going to be sewing this next few weeks before christmas and new year so those are the fabrics the first one that i'm going to show you guys is this red satin yours and i ha i know what i'm going to make i'm making a very a mini skirt with ruffles I don't know how to explain it is in my head but when i'm when i'm when you see the tutorial you know what i mean like yeah okay you know this is the perfect fabric and it's just a normal satin i like the texture i like that it's very stiff because i don't want it to be too uh, uh light i also have another satin that is super light but for this skirt i wanted a very stiff satin and i bought one yard of this uh fabric i'm going to put the link of the uh, the website because i finally found a website to where I buy these fabrics and this is a Dutch website I think if you're from Europe you can order from there I'm going to put the link below this is not a sponsored video I just found them and I love their fabric and I bought fabrics from that website so like I said I'm going to link the website below so you can go check them out so this is the first one and it's a one yard and the other satin fabric that I told you it is a this oh can you see this color how do you even call this this is not gold it's like I don't know how do you call this rosé no i don't know tell me my brain i'm still suffering from pregnancy brain though so don't mind me if i say stuff that doesn't make sense but this color i saw it i said oh i have to get it so you can see this is another kind of satin this is like crepe satin it has like a little bit of texture in it and i'm going to be making either a, a, a mini strap like dress or a wrap with a high slit dress and i got two yards of this as well i haven't decided what what exactly i'm going to be making with this fabric and then the fabric is just a plain i got really i got a really vibrant color this is another red fabric it's a double knitted uh uh fabric it's super thick and it's super stretchy and i think i'm going to be making either like a pant and a mini crop top to go with it or a dress either pants or dress i don't know yet so there's some fabric that i really still need you guys help to like give me inspiration of what you guys would what you guys think i can make of it and this is a this is one of them and i have two and a half yards so i have enough to make a wide leg pants i do think it's gonna look super cute with a wide leg pants what do you guys think so this red one as well and then moving on to the velvet fabric because you know the velvet fabric always have to be there because and i got this cream it it might come off white on the camera but it's cream and i saw this dress from um, asos it was so beautiful but it was just too pricey and it was so simple i saw it, it wasn't for me it wasn't even necessarily this price it was just the fact that it's really simple and i said you know what i can make this and the, it was in this uh kind of fabric probably the other fabric might be more the quality might be a little bit more than this but this can this fabric will do this fabric in this color this aubergine color can you see this eggplant look at this kind of dark rich purplish color it's like between reddish and purplish like the color that the camera doesn't even do it justice look how beautiful this velvet fabric is and this is a very good quality velvet fabric and i also got two yards 
I don't know what I'm going to make of this yet. So if you have any ideas, definitely comment below or send me a picture on Instagram. I'm going to put the name of my Instagram here so you can send me a picture so I can use that as an inspiration for this fabric because I still don't know what I'm going to make with this fabric. But this color is just so rich that I needed to get it. And do you want to know the price? This was one, I think two euros per meter. They were having like a discount the day I went on the website. Like this website, you guys need to check it out. If you live in Europe, this is definitely a website you should put an eye. The fabric starts from one euro a meter and they are pretty good fabrics there. So this one is definitely something I need you guys to help me to give me some inspiration of what I should make of uh, this fabric. Moving on to the last, do I still have, oh yeah, I still have not, not the last, to um the last holiday fabric because all the fabric that i've been showing you guys are all the items that i want to make for christmas and new year's eve parties and this is the last one this fabric is so pretty it's so chic look at it it is this jacquard print green dark green fabric look at that print do you see how amazing this is and i'm going to be making a mini dress with some puff puff sleeve because i feel like this fabric needs to be dramatic the uh, the, the, the the i mean that the item or the outfit you're making should be very dramatic because the fabric itself is dramatic so it's just going to be like a very fitted mini dress like a straight short but the sleeves are going to be super poofy like yes i have an idea in my head so you guys know i'm always about these ideas in my head but when i make it it turns out good hopefully i hopefully it turns out good the way i imagine it in my head and i got um, also two yards of this right two yards of this and this was three three years a meter so six years for two yards i had to get it because it looks so expensive looks so chic and the color palette is just so perfect for the holiday season and i needed to get it just like regular fabrics but for now they're like really really good for the winter and the color the colors in them i got this fabric it is so funky the color combinations in here is just so amazing it's just a plain cotton it's not really heavy as you can see it's not stretchy so i'm definitely going to be making either simple pants or uh, a flowy dress or a wrap skirt or whatever so i really still don't know yet exactly what i want to make with this fabric but i just saw it and i said i needed to get it because it's just so cute i just love the colors i also have two yards of this so if you guys can like let me know or give me some inspiration of what you guys will want me to make this with it will be amazing so moving on to the last fabric that I have right now I have other fabrics but I don't want to show them now because they kind of don't come to, they don't come together with this set of fabric that I have so probably in the next fabric haul I'm going to be showing you guys a few other ones and the final fabric is this polka dot like chiffon it's not really chiffon it's a bit thicker than chiffon because it's not see-through and i just had to get it because i love it it's super light it's gonna be super flowy you know those wrap dresses or even uh a pants it can also look good in a pants or a wrap skirt or blouse still don't know what i'm going to make with this fabric so you guys can vote though i'm going to take a picture of this fabric when i'm ready to make it and then you know that you can vote now on instagram i'm going to Put, ask you guys if you guys want me to make a blouse a uh, pants or a dress with this and probably we'll see what the people would want me to make with this fabric so yes this is also two yards and this was on discount I got it one euro a yard so I paid two euros for this and this one was also one euro a yard so I paid two euros so these two fabrics are four euros like I got so much discount on this fabric I think I have about one two three four five six seven eight fabrics and i think i spent maybe 25 euros for those which is really really cheap compared to the money i spend on fabric because i do spend a lot of money on fabric so those 
those are the fabrics I have in stock right now. Those are the fabrics I'm going to be the tutorials that, I, that you can expect in the next two, three weeks. So yes, that is it. I hope you guys love the collections that I've shown you guys. And please definitely go follow me on Instagram or just comment below on this video to tell me all the inspirations you guys want me to make because I do need your help. I know we just passed 100k and I'm so, so blessed and so happy that even my, with my absence of three months, you guys keep subscribing and keep watching my videos. I am so, so happy. That's going to be another another video because i need to celebrate it and i need you guys have been asking a lot of questions so i won't do a, a q a dedicated to my 100k and i put in something together to give you guys back because i feel 100k you guys deserve a mega giveaway so that's going to be a total new video i did not forget thank you guys so so much but it's going to be a dedicated video to us celebrating our milestone of 100k thank you guys so so much i'm going to see you guys very soon with the first tutorial of the holiday series and make sure to like share comment and subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed yet and also before i go if you want to see my birth and labor stories and videos and vlogs i have them on my vlog channel so even though i've been away for the past three months i've been very active on my vlog channel so you might have been seeing me there compared to this channel so i'm going to link the name of my vlog channel below and also here yeah, so you can go check those videos out if you're interested so that's it for today thank you guys so so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye